So right when this channel started to blow up, I got, um, you know, I was doing a giveaway and I got behind, man. The channel's been growing so fast and the support has been just amazing. You guys don't understand the, the amount of appreciation I feel with, not, you know, 99.9% .9 of you here. There's some trolls here, but you know what? You guys are good people and I appreciate it. I was doing a giveaway and I got behind, weeks behind, almost three weeks behind because I couldn't keep up with everything, doing my job during the day, putting out content, and then having to, sometimes until midnight, respond and try to help people, emails and stuff like that. Um, so I know how Ford Makey Loco feels when he said that it's just kind of hard to keep up with everything plus run multiple businesses at the same time. It's one of those things where I'm starting to feel the same effect right now, working at the dealer full time and then running the channel, um, helping as many people as I can and just trying to build a network of good quality technicians and people that want to be in the car community and stuff in general. You guys are amazing. Uh, I, I got to get those, uh, the giveaway away. So I got to get some spark plugs out. I think it was like an air filter, brake pads and stuff like that, all OEM. Um, so that's what I'm going to do right now on my lunch break. Like I never take a lunch break, but today I got caught up with all my work that I was behind and I was just given three more jobs. One of them is a motor job where it sounds like the rods coming out of the motor and uh, literally just dung, 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 lack of oil pressure and stuff. Uh, it's all kinds of stuff going on with this thing. And then I got two more motor issues where motors making sounds and stuff like that. And then an electrical diag and I don't know, it's just... It's crazy having to do everything and then still keep up with this. Um, I'm learning to manage it more and more, but I'm going to go get those parts sent out now. And to the people that uh, have been waiting, I apologize. I'm sorry that you've had to wait so long, and I'm going to go get that stuff out right now. Okay, guys, I did get everything mailed off. Um, the guy at the post office was super cool. He helped me save a bunch of money by figuring out how to actually package things correctly and stuff like that. So that was awesome. Uh, this is just trying to make sure that I don't here's the got it done parts sent off and again I do apologize for taking so long it's just it's been crazy trying to keep up with everything and then uh, the guy at the post office now he asked for my YouTube link and you guys hey say hi if you see this video man I appreciate you today what's his name um, I don't know if their name is actually on here or not I don't know, I don't see a name, but uh, you said you're gonna check out my videos later, so uh, say hi so everybody uh, can see. What an awesome person you are. Thank you for helping me save money to get this stuff out to people. And it's kind of cool because uh, when I said I'm putting spark plugs in here, do you have any uh, paper I can shove down in this box so the spark plugs don't bounce around and crack? And he was like, oh, I know how it is. And then he showed me his tattoo on his forearm. It was a picture of a spark plug, which is pretty badass. And I was like, man, that's cool, man. And you just, meet gearheads everywhere and he's into like old 60s model chevys and stuff like that pretty cool dude so shout out to him at the dundee post office thank you guys for being awesome and helping people like me save money when we're trying to help other people as well so you're amazing and uh thanks guys i appreciate your patience and stuff like that and you should have your parts soon uh spark plugs air filter e350 brake pads all oem uh, nobody had the e350 brake pads in stock so i had to actually order them and then wait days for them to show up Finally, it was, I think it was like a, a late 90s model or something like that from what I remember. I ordered it by VIN, so everything got ordered by VIN. So the, the people that are here on this channel that do get parts are getting parts that are OEM for their VIN number. Thank you. Be blessed, guys.